here is the shortest short trick for solving this quadratic equation 21x square minus 13x minus 20 equal to 0. Now most of the students will get stuck how to split the middle term. So let me just simplify it for you. The sum has to be this middle number right a plus b is equal to negative 13 and the product has to be the product of the coefficient of x square that is 21 and the constant term which is minus 20. So if you multiply these two it is going to be a huge task because this will give you a big number. So instead of multiplying these two split 21 as 7 times 3 that is the only way you can do it and split 20 you can do it in a different manner. So let's have two numbers which are very close together like 20 is 4 into 5. Now we have four numbers but we want only two numbers. So we will regroup them like 21 and 20 doesn't work. So we can try 35 and 12. 35 and 12 will not give me a 13 on addition or subtraction. So I need to make some you know hit and trial and let's try 7 into 4 that gives me 28 and 3 into 5 that gives me 15. Now 28 and 15 I can obtain a 13 from that by subtracting these two and therefore the middle term split factors because this is negative the larger one will be negative and the smaller one will be positive. Now after getting the middle term split factors just change the sign so this becomes plus and this becomes minus and divide by the coefficient of x square that is 21 and you will be surprised that when you reduce it to the lowest form this will give you 4 upon 3 and this will give you minus and I think the common factor here is 3 right so 5 by 7 minus 5 by 7 now you can check whether these roots are correct or not 